You know, and the Prophet ﷺ told us, he said, خيركم 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 He said that the best among you are the best to your family and I am the best to my family. Why does the hadith not say خيركم خيركم, the best of you are the best to your communities? Or the best of you are the ones who give the best speeches? Or the best of you are the ones who give the best halaqas? Or the best of you are the best at work? Because it's really easy to be good outside. It's really easy to be nice to the people at work because if you're not, they're going to subtweet you on Twitter. And if you're not, they're going to think you're terrible and they're going to have this illusion of who you are and they're going to talk bad about you. But if you do something bad to your mom, she's not going to disown you, I hope. You know, if you're disrespecting your sister, she's still going to be your sister. But if you do something bad on the outside, you can potentially ruin a relationship. And so that's why it's easy for us to be good on the outside, but it's hard to be good at home. And that's why the hadith goes that the best of you are the best to your family because your true character comes out at home. When you've had a long day at work or a long day at school, you face a lot of difficulties, a lot of struggle, you've had a hard day, and you've tucked it in so no one sees it of you, no one sees the flaws, no one sees the weaknesses. But then you go home and you unleash the monster. You unleash the thing that's been building within you the entire day. And who do you unleash it to? The people that you should care about most. The people that deserve the most respect from you.